menstrual blood clots form when your uterus sheds more endometrial tissue than it can expel as liquid. So blood pools, coagulates, and is then passed as clots. But if you are seeing larger or more frequent clotting, even in the absence of iron deficiency, because that can lead to that too, then you might have underlying root causes that can lead to this. And one of them, one of them, is chronic low-grade inflammation from refined oils, leaky gut, environmental toxins, gluten sensitivity, celiac disease, and all of that upregulates fibrinogen. And that's tipping your hemostatic balance toward clot formation, even in a normal cycle. If you haven't audited your inflammatory load, food triggers, mold, unresolved infections, you're essentially pouring gasoline on the flame of clotting. I don't stop talking about inflammation for a reason in my fertility circle because it is so important. If you need help to get your menstrual cycle in order, then go and join my fertility circle because large blood clots are not normal.